Stephen Forster will spend three years behind the bars of a federal prison, minus time served after pleading guilty to accessory after the fact. Forster helped his son Matthew escape by purchasing a fake identity for $500 and sending him to Ontario. Matthew is serving 25 years for the first degree murder of Taylor Van Deest. I was hoping it would be closer to five years, but I guess um, considering case law that three years was in the range of uh, what he could expect. Stephen Forrester apologized for his crime during the court proceedings. It was really, um, really pathetic. I think the thing he was sorry for was the fact that he couldn't go forward with trial. It just would have cost him too much and I think that's why he decided to plead the way he did. Crown and defense decided on a joint submission, but the judge alluded to the fact that if the decision hadn't been made between counsels, he may have opted for a longer sentence. Then in this case, the range was between 18 months and five years. And luckily, we didn't need to go through some of the cases um, because of the joint submission. But in, in the Van Dies position, of course, I think it would be uh, not enough. What's enough? Stephen Forrester also has a lengthy criminal record dating back to 1969, including auto theft, drug offenses and escape from custody.